Welcome to Zoo Tampa at Lowry Park. We are so excited to have everybody here today. This is the second annual Family Fun Day that we put on in conjunction with Champions for Children and Layla's House. This is truly my favorite day of the year. One of the things that we tell people is the zoo's not just about animals. Um, we want to connect people to nature and we want to connect people to wildlife, but even more importantly, we want to connect them to each other. Today we have about 600 of our families coming to the zoo to see animals that they would never have an opportunity to see anywhere else. Show me how long is this there. <laughs> it's very educational and they're having fun, you know. You, you can't beat it. It's got a lot to offer like the flash pad when it starts getting a little too hot. We love that. And also my, my girls love to read, getting like the literacy resources and those types of things. It was a lot of fun. This is a really cool nest too because it's almost like a cocoon. So it actually wow. builds around it and they hide themselves inside that nest. What kind of egg is that? Can you read that? It also helps with the bonding on the weekends. I mean, I mean sometimes parents can't get out with their kids and if you set that date and you know you're going to do something like that, it helps you helps you make sure it's there. <laughs> it makes you make sure it's there. It brings families together because not many not many families can afford to come to places like this. So it's nice that, sorry, it's nice that they're willing to help low-income families like myself to help my daughter enjoy. Because what I can't provide for her, they're helping. We just really want to thank the, the sponsors that made this event happen, Cy and Joanne Sperlino, the Florida Blue Foundation, Mosaic, and Catalina. Without the support of these individuals and corporations, we wouldn't be able to make these opportunities possible.